Good morning guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm just going to show you my basic makeup routine or what I do every day to get ready in the morning. I start off with my e.l.f. moisture mist and I just spritz this on my face. If I'm looking down, I'm looking at my mirror here, um, I kind of just put that on, get my face a little bit moist and ready for makeup. And I don't use a whole lot of stuff with just basic routine. Um, but what I do use is first the Mineral Face Primer by e.l.f. I'm going to put a little bit of that on. Bit of that on. The next thing that I'm going to do is work on my brows. They're a little messed up. <clears throat> right now I'm using the uh, LA Colors brow pencil. So I'm going to use this to do my brows. I'm going to get my spoolie, which is an e.l.f. spoolie, and I'm just going to kind of comb them into position first. I'm going to outline them next. Okay, so that's kind of what they're looking like now. Comb them again into position. Kind of get this edge here a little. You don't want it to be so defined on that edge. You don't want it to look like really thick. You want the beginning. Well, I aim for the beginning to be a little faded. So I do this. I pull it back to make it look a little faded. It's all blending, I guess. Then I go in with my LA Girl Concealer and this is in Toffee and I use this to uh, outline the eyes. I'm going to use my e.l.f. concealer brush to do this. You're just going under just to define that eye brow a bit. Just kind of cleaning up where you may have like some new growth from your hair. Just a little bit of hair growing in. And I just take whatever's left on the brush and I just put it over the top. Kind of clean up the top a bit. And then I kind of just blend it out. The other thing that I do, so this won't look so blunt right here, I take whatever's left on the brush and I kind of just blend out the beginning portion to kind of fade it out even further. So I'm just rubbing it through the front to kind of fade it out so it'll look a little bit more natural. Okay, so that's that. And then you just repeat the same thing on the other eye. The other eye is done. And this is just simple. What I do just on a daily. I don't go for a really big, you know, like eye brow doing. I don't do it up too big. I just do something simple on an every for an everyday thing. Okay, so that's that's the eyebrows. Okay, so the next thing I do is I take LA Girl Concealer and this one is in toast and I put this under my eyes to get rid of my um dark circles and one thing you need to know about this is when it gets to the end it's hard to get to get it out like there's some product in here I, I could tell but it gets harder to get it out when you get to the end like you have to really push through to get it out right but I put this under my eye like this like so stab that on like that okay and I also have colored dark colors and then dark circles underneath here so I go ahead around my mouth and put this around my mouth as well okay so then I look like this 
I take my e.l.f. blush brush and this is a studio line and I get my bottle of water here and I just mist it a little bit with the water and I go in and blend this in. Go ahead and blend it out. Mm -hmm. Well, blend this out. And with whatever's left on my brush, I go back up here and kind of just blend out that little highlight that I may have had around my eyebrows. Blend that out. And just make sure that it's very blended out because you don't want there to be any like residue or areas. So kind of almost you could use this as foundation. I know a lot of people do use it as foundation. So yeah, just got to get it all nice and blended. So the next thing I'm going to use is my Black Radiant. Um, this is Enriched Mahogany and I use this to just kind of contour a little bit. But this is an everyday routine so I'm not doing anything that's like super duper harsh contour. I'm just going to kind of just add some color underneath that um, contour, the um, concealer that I just did. And this is a Wet n Wild Fergie brush. So I take a little bit of this and then I just put it right here. Just, just put it right here. And I kind of use this almost, I'd say, as a base for a blush that I'm about to put on. So I kind of just do this. And I have this blush palette here, and don't mind this on the front, but this blush palette is by Clean Color. It is the Make Me Blush Palette, and these are the colors, and I love this palette because if you do not know, like, this is like a highlighter here. These are all neutral tones for contouring, and the, this is like a pink, pinky, and like a nude tone, if you can see that. And this is a great palette. So I got this from Shop Miss A for one dollar so if you guys are interested shop me say one dollar it's the clean color make me blush so I'm going to take um, this color here and this color mix it together and put it on as my uh, blush today and it kind of gives me a little pink just like a little bit of a red color or uh, it's because it's, it's like a hmm I don't know how to it's almost like a cinnamon color. Cinnamon is what I would say. But it just looks like brown. It doesn't even look like I have a lot of color on. If you can see that. This doesn't really look like I have color on. But it warms up my face. I just really want to do it for warming up my face. Okay, so that's that. Okay. Next thing that I will do is I will add just a little bit of color to the lids. Just a little bit. Um... I'm not sure what I want to do today. Um, I know I need to set my under eye concealer first. Um, set my LA Girl. I'm going to use my e.l.f. bronzer in Glow. And yeah, I do use a, bl a bronzer to set. And I'm going to use my um, another Fergie brush. And I just get a little bit of this on and dust it off and then I just pat it in. And this is going to set my concealer. So it sets it and then it get, also gives it a little bit of a highlight at the very same time. And I brush the excess off on my nose and up here. Without using a highlight on it every day, it just gives me a little bit of a highlight. Because it stands out. It stands out from the... Um, it stands out from the other blushes that I just used. So this is a good thing for me. So um, on a normal day, I would just let that concealer sit on the color on the you know on my lid. Um, and I wouldn't I would not put a color on, but I'm gonna put a color on today. Because I just want to deepen it up a little bit. So I'm going into my little homemade Z palette and I'm going to pull out I'm going to use Saddle from um, Elf and just a little bit in the crease just to define it a little bit. Just for a little bit of definition. 
because I don't want my eyes to all just look like it's one color. You know how that could be? So I'm just blending this really, really good in the crease. Okay, so that's all I wanted to do with that. Just put that color in there just to have a little bit of, of you know, dimension. So I am going to be using my e.l.f. Volumizing Mascara. I'm going to put some of this on. And on top of it, I'm going to be using my Rimmel Scandal Eyes Mascara. So I'm going to put those on now. Okay, so that's the first round. Now I'm going in with the Rimmel. Now I'm going in with the Rimmel. Look how big this brush is. It's cool. Okay, so that's what it looks like with the mascara on. So, the last thing I do is lips. I take this Nobby N-A-B-I lip liner in brown and I got this from the 99 cent store over here and I'm gonna line my lips. On an everyday basis I just try to keep it very natural. I don't really go all out. And I'm gonna be using my MAC Creme de la Creme. I lie. Creme de la Nude today and this is what I'm going to use I can get it out to, um, and this is what it looks like. Mm, it is so pretty. It is a really creamy nude. It's a cream sheen, and this is what I use. Let me give you guys a little bit of a swatch. You can see what that looks like. Can you see? See, it's just a very cream color. It's very cool. Very cool for a nude. That's that. Um, sometimes I put a little lip gloss over it, so I think I'm going to go ahead and do that today. I'm going to use this CoverGirl one. It's just random. And it's very creamy. And I, I guess that's hence the name Cream Sheen. So that's a little bit of this on um, for a little bit of a shine. There you go. So this pretty much is my everyday makeup look. I close it out with another spritz of my e.l.f. Makeup Mist and spray. Got to be careful because these bottom lashes will touch. But this is what I do. And my hair, of course, I told you is in that Brazilian thing. And I just did not curl it yet. But anyway, um, so this is the finished everyday makeup look. So I hope you guys like it. Look forward to more videos and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.